as satire and not factual information. We may address real life events through satire, but only to entertain our audience. What's up my dudes, welcome to the Fake Night Show Meme Review, and in this episode we're going to review 2021 in memes. So sit down and relax, it's going to be a blast. <laughs> this time you won't see my wonderful face, so here, here's another face reveal so you don't forget me. This is what happens when you hack your wife's uh, TikTok account. We got no time to lose. So much happened this year. So let's get started. As last year, the focus this year was on a virus. A virus that shocked the whole world. And of course, this virus came from China. You know what I'm talking about. The rise of TikTok became unstoppable. With stupid challenges like the skull breaker challenge, baby swing challenge, the wax face challenge, the corn bob challenge, the oh! or the coronavirus challenge, where people started to lick plain toilet seats. These challenges proved how retarded the new TikTok generation really is. Furthermore, we got the shit talk challenges like the blackout challenge, the dipping challenge or the pee your pants challenge. And then we had another virus. And even though we did everything we could to protect ourselves from Covid, at this moment stoppen we with handen schudden. Dus je kunt uh, voet zoenen, u kunt elleboog stoten wat u ook wilt. Uh, ik zie op school allerlei prachtige varianten op het handen schudden al ontstaan. Uh, maar we stoppen vanaf vandaag met handen schudden. The virus continued to spread rapidly. <coughs> Then we had a political earthquake in the USA. Trump had to go, people stormed the Capitol, and the grandson of Ambrose Finnegan became the new American president. Grandpapa's name Ambrose, Ambrose Finnegan. As kitchen table I learned a lot of basic lessons. And then a photo of Bernie Sanders went viral. But now let's stop the political bullshit. Now watch this drive. Because this year was also the year of technical innovations. When lying down to play with the phone at night, we can easily be hit by the phone and lose sleep. So, I invented this fast sleep phone case, when we are hit by the phone. Not only will we not lose sleep, and it will make us fall asleep quickly. Very easy to use. Unfortunately, not everyone could keep up with the newest technology. I don't know how to remove it. I've got my assistant here. She's trying to, but uh, I'm prepared to go forward with it. That's, I'm here live. That's not, I'm not a cat. We got to see the first physical online fight ever. Alright. 
And after the Facebook blackout, the sweet baby race addict, the lizard king. No, I'm not. I am I am not a lizard. Presented his new metaverse. Hiring view of whatever you find most beautiful. Do the video call. I want to fuck you, please. Yeah, just gotta find something to wear. All right, perfect. Biggest sporting event of the year were definitely the Olympics in Tokyo. Here are the highlights again in case you missed them. And after that, the world stood still. We got the biggest time of the year. The Squid Game. But of course, it was also a tough year for the world. We lost legends like Norm Macdonald, Spanish comedian famous for his love, El Risitas, DMX, and Star Wars fans all over the world were shocked because the Galactic Emperor died. Rest in peace, King of the Undead, Prince Philip. Yeah, it was a tough year because we lost so many people. But it became even tougher because we kept Ted Cruz. You know, Ted's always kind of freaky. He eats hair, human hair. He's the first one to say, let's go out and eat hair. It's wonderful now and again. See? Mm, hair. But of course, life has to go on. And so it did. The former adult movie star Lana Rhodes announced her pregnancy and the memes went crazy. Her kid will benefit from the expertise of its mother. <laughs> Girls, if you want to try anal with your boyfriend, I've got the tips. And so after you do the clean out, if you have a butt plug, try to stretch your butthole out with that or just use your fingers. Stretch it out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it is not going to be the worst video that it finds when it Googles his mother. And now some more headlines in a quick run through. Pete Davidson banged Kim Kardashian. This woman from Belgium wanted to bang a monkey and was therefore banned from the zoo. We had some crazy movies like The New Matrix. Spider-Man No Way Home with our homie Toby. Pizza time. Dune. And of course, tears for breast milk. Then Jesus appeared inside the tangerine. And New Zealand City took its official wizard of the payroll after over two decades. Shakiro was attacked by a pair of wild boars. A bishop stepped down after falling in love with his antenna themed erotica author and the queen showed her happy face. Really is enjoying today and she's enjoying the moment. I mean, we saw the smile on her face. The PlayStation hype continued. Got a brand new baby right here, you know what I'm saying? What? And we learned the most important lesson of the year from Jeff Bezos. <laughs> <laughs> Even if you are one of the richest men in the world, 
with Mr. Leonardo DiCaprio still could steal your girl. So this is it my dudes. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you have a wonderful start to the new year and we'll see us in 2022. Ich bin ein Trottel. So. So.